And should you murder me, remember you murder your sister and you murder your queen. So today we've come to Fovering here and here there is a castle or ruins of a castle what's left. Um, so we've taken a history lesson for these two outdoors and uh, it's literally just about 20 minutes from our house so we're really really lucky to have this and it's steeped in history. Fotheringay Castle was built by the Earl of Northampton and Huntingdon around 1100 AD. It later became property of the Crown and was the birthplace for King Richard III. King Richard met his death at the Battle of Bosworth and the castle was passed down the royal bloodline until it came to Henry VIII who gave it to his wife Catherine of Aragon. This castle is most famous for the imprisonment, trial and execution of Mary Queen of Scots where she was found guilty and executed in 1587 in the Great Hall. This is what remains of the castle. Wow. So, there is the famous castle site right there. This is the moat around it. Here we are. So, girls, that's what it used to look like right there. The castle was on top of the hill, right up there. Can we go yeah, we're going to go up there in a minute. Can anyone spot where this moat was to protect the castle? Can you see where it might be in the ruins? No, I don't. I, I can see it. <gasps> yeah. Scarlett, I think you're all right. Good girls, well done. So the moat was right there around the outside. And can anybody see where this like little village would have been here? Up there. Up you think there. the village was up there? Up there? Yeah. Really? Oh, think about Look it. at the picture. Down. Yes, over there. there. Down so over there. the village was over in that point. Yeah, yeah, and then the castle was right at the top up there. Incredible. Mary, Queen of Scots, was held prisoner for execution at Fotheringhay in February 1587. So it's so good that the moat is still here that went round. The castle was right at the top, just up there. And then the other sort of, originally the villagey sort of bit was here, but then another part of the castle was built there as well. So this is the whole site, but incredible history. Here we are, right at the top. The castle was right here where we're standing. We're standing right where the castle was. When kings and queens used to be here. So here's a view from here. You can see the church in the background. See so far. Amazing view. So this is an actual piece from the castle. That's a real piece from the castle. It's protected here. And if you look at this, the youngest son of Richard, King Richard III, Duke of York and Sicily Neville was born here in this castle on October 2nd, 1452. Crazy. This is where the Mary, the Queen of Scots, was beheaded. Right here in Fotheringay Castle. So it's incredible to think that the Mary, Queen of Scots, was actually beheaded right here. And this is a memorial for her that's set up. And all over, like the castle grounds, there's thistle everywhere. And if you have a look on this memorial, They've got thistle that's been put in there. Can you see it, girls? Yeah. So that is like the thistle flower, and it's the memorial for Mary Queen of Scots. Well, I want to ask the question, Daddy. Do you know why there might be a thistle there? No, go on. <laughs> a little bit of knowledge that I've just got. That the thistle is actually, girls, the national flower of Scotland. Wow. Oh. So there's thistles planted everywhere on there and, as you can see, built into the memorial. A history 
lesson over, girls. Time for lunch. Let's go for some lunch. <laughs> Scarlet, mm -hmm. is it good? Mm. Oh, that way, like the sun's just trying to break for a little bit, and it, you it's can tell if a car won't let it be so nice. Spicy. Or no, it is, that's the mustard in it. You can see that it's pouring down now, and over there, the cloud starters. Oh, yeah. Mm. So do you feel that you're going to give birth soon? I reckon it could be any moment. I reckon if I did more of walking around, yeah. she might come. Really? Get, yeah, because I get more pain. It's like walking to the toilet at the moment. I can feel loads of stuff yeah. going on. Whereas when I spend a day sitting down, I don't really feel anything. And because the weather's been bad, we haven't been out. Yeah. Doing anything. So we need to do like maybe a little bit more walk, like Never a bit more. of a shuffle. Yeah. And see <laughs> if we get some waddle. movement going. Bit of a <laughs> we'll eat this snack and then I think we might be headed. Who brought me this nice flower? Me! Oh, it's my favourite. What is it? It's like a yellow. It's not a buttercup, is it? No, it's not. I don't it's know. Like it's like open. It's really it's flat. Dandelion. It's not, not a dandelion. dandelion. What is it? I don't know what it is, but it's nice. It's like got yellow love hearts on it. Did you enjoy your history lesson? Yep. Who remembers? <laughs> Who remembers what king was born in the castle? I don't. Scarlett, do you remember? No! King Richard the Third. Yes. Oh! All right, do you know this one though? Scarlett might know this one. Yeah. Who, what queen had her head chopped off there? Go on, go on, you can get oh, it. Rosie the Third. Rosie the Third? <laughs> Who's Rosie the Third? Mary <laughs> the Third. Ooh, Scarlet, Mary the Third, that was close. It was Mary, Queen of Scots. Now here is a big question that you should get. What colour was the special flower that we saw? Does, Does that mean I remember, remember the it word? It was called a thistle. What was the colour of the thistle? Purple. Yes, Scarlet, it was purple. Scarlet. Scarlet's favourite colour. I'm debating on a, a fast food chain. Well, we haven't had any fast food for months, like three months, because it's all been closed. And it's nearly six o'clock yeah. now. Yeah, I think this definitely warrants getting fast food. So we need to think of where we want to go. Obviously, the drive throughs are open, our takeaways, whatever. So we'll work out what we're going to get, but I think it would, this definitely warrants fast food. I reckon? think so, and I think drop the girls off because all of us. Who needs a wee? Who needs a wee? Are you holding it, girls? Yeah. Yeah. All of us yeah, girls so need a weed, and no one cares about that either. No one cares wee. about me. <laughs> I don't need a wee, but I can drop you off, and I've got to get whatever. What we're feeling, KFC. I'm feeling a KFC. Girls, would you like a KFC? Yeah. I'm also feeling a KFC. Popcorn chicken? And a bit. KFC's here! KFC! 
<laughs> so I've been out, I've got the goods. Um, we haven't had like KFC, McDonald's or anything like that for months. Um, we don't really eat it much anyway, but usually it's like a nice treat for the girls. But I think Tamira and myself, because we both love the same food, basically really wanted a KFC today. As soon as we drove past it, it was like KFC had to happen. Right, is everyone happy? Yeah. Yeah? Scarlett, are you happy? Yeah. Have we had a good day? Yeah. It's been really good. This is the perfect finish to the day. Perfect finish. So worn out. Woo! So I'm coming at you from the editing suite right now because I've just finished editing this whole video and it took so much work. So I hope you enjoyed it. I really liked how it turned out myself. So if you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. Let me know. Also throw some comments down below. Let me know what you think. But we will be back later on this week with another video and a baby update. Hopefully there's still no sign yet, but I think it's getting closer. So stay tuned. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and we'll see you in the next one.